What is up guys, my name is Sky Nyom and today we are looking at a mod called The Legend of Notch and to be honest with you I have tried to record an LP for it for my 200th video but it didn't work out well because the mod is still in early development and stuff like that so it was a problem because when I did some quests the king actually despawned and this is a mushroom biome. My kingdom is in a mushroom biome. Wow. Man, this is this is actually pretty amazing pretty amazing. I have never spawned in a mushroom biome. And the kingdom is in one mushroom biome. And right next to a jungle biome. Man! Impressive seed is impressive. If you wanna know the seed, it's right there. Let's pick it up. Anyway, let's go on to the mod review. And the mod should have asked me if I want, um, I mean, should have asked me to choose my class and stuff, but it didn't because I need to restart my Minecraft, so I'll be back. Chances are, even though I spawned a new world, it'll ask me again for my class. Yep. So you can be a warrior, you can be an assassin, a mage or an orc. And on the right side you can see extreme attack uh, fast health regeneration and extreme defense but um, very low mana very low speed and low mana regeneration for a mage of course high very fast uh, mana regeneration and uh, stuff like that so an assassin of course extremely fast uh, pretty good attack and of course low mana and for a warrior um, the mana is actually not that bad, but it has good health regeneration, great melee damage, and great defense. So now you need to level up this. I have no idea what this is. Didn't say on the forum. Anyway, on the right hand, uh, actually, on the right hand corner, you can see the race minimap mod. I would like to disable that right now. Actually, I'm gonna keep it. Whatever. So on the left, the re left hand side, you can see that I am actually level one. And you can see my health, my mana. Stupid cars! God damn it! Every time I try to record something, stupid cars are like, oh, you're recording. <laughs> and then they like stay there for like 10 minutes and don't even turn off their engines. Oh, super friendly, man. You're a good man. Thank you. Oh, God. Anyway. So. Let's go to the main thing here, which is this man right here, and he is the king. So welcome in our lovely kingdom, Traveler. You look like someone who likes adventures, am I right? Yep. And now he gives you a quest to level up, uh, actually to get a wooden sword, I'm on my way. So let's spawn in one wooden sword, I even have too many items, which is not really necessary. But um, tell me what to do, so now he tells me to, to get to level 3. So let me get let's get here some zombies, not much creepers, not much creepers. Let's get here some zombies and when I kill them they actually still have their corpse down there laying on the ground. So I am level one still on the zombies as well. Oh, sorry. They don't intend to do that. Still level one, let's spawn a few of them. I cannot use a stronger sword though because I'm still level one. So I can only use tools that re don't require too high a level. So I'm actually now level two, as you can see. So let's kill a few more of those and see. Level three, nice. So if I would take here a stone sword, for example, as you can see, it says damage six, durability 131, and required a level five. For a wooden sword, it is. Uh, required level zero so I can actually use it Wow zombie I can even push your corp corpse yeah pushing your zombies corpse for the win I'll just push this zombie into the other zombie I cannot do that anyway let's go to this man yes I am now level three I want my reward where the heck is my cursor at I cannot move my cursor yep I changed my resolution so I can see my cursor now so, I completed one quest, you're doing pretty well, but I have another task for you, are and supplies, blah, blah, blah. So, I should be mining, get some ingots, and so on and so forth. 
So that's pretty much how that works. Over 30 quests, I think there is. So now let's go over the weapons. I don't want to go over all the quests, so whatever. So as you can see, quite a lot of weapons here. A lot of weapons which I cannot use. Require level 65, man. As you can see, it drops down immediately. So let me show you some more features of that this mod has to offer. So when you right click on, on him, he tells you something. Did you hear that Frank was killed by a zombie yesterday? No, I didn't. I can trade with him, but it's not really trading because he offers me something for coins. And coins are dropped by um, zombies, skeletons, and all the mobs. So when you kill a mob, you'll get coins. And as you can see, the white coins and the just next to my health bar are the coins actually yeah so if I click yes I don't have enough money so let's go with no and I can steal something from him and didn't get to steal it because he asks me what am I doing and I'm trying to make something for a living here what am I doing oh my god I'm trying to steal here I'm trying to be, be a nice man and steal stuff from you because so I wanna live actually I cannot live if you don't allow me to steal stuff from you, stupid motherfuckers. How can I make a living without stealing them? Ah, oh, thank you for the boat. I don't really need it. This was just the purpose of demonstration. There's a bug though. Um, when I actually trade with something, if I can... Why did I, why did I drop the boat? If I can manage to get something else. So, if I now le left click on it, even in... Oh, it's actually working now. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> was a bug that happened to me so a lot of items have been added um, some amulets that are not working at the moment uh, armor bosses over 65 uh, mobs new mobs in the game overall um, let me here go to spawn eggs I can't even spawn all of them this is only for the nether for example the Ender Mage, Ender Warrior, um, Creeper Stone, I have no idea what it is, but let's spawn it in. Oh shit, what about this one? Why doesn't he want to spawn? Maybe he only can, yeah, he probably only, whoa, whoa, Creeper Stone. Okay, I got it. So the Ender Mage is probably like a boss because there are some semi bosses around here that you can find in dungeons and stuff like that. So um, they can probably only spawn there, I would assume. But they can spawn the what's it called? Creeper Stone. I want to kill it. Ha! Huh. Ha! Huh. I hit it. Anyway, so over 65 new mobs over 100 over 100 new items have been added new structures i would like to show off the new structures but looks like i spawned on a little island which is a bummer if i would start a let's play here oh that wouldn't end that well would it because i am in a mushroom biome right now which is not the best thing ever, but um, the spawn is quite nice. So anyway, that's pretty much everything the mod has to offer at this very moment. And why does this look so plain? Hmm. Suspicious. So as you can see, I'm getting mining levels. Oh shit. This should be one of the new ores. Yeah, the cobalt ore. So, I would like to find some of the new mobs if I could manage to do so. Doesn't look like it's mining level plus one. Come on, go up, stupid motherfucker. Anyway, anyway, I would like to start an LP on it, but there are a lot of bugs that need to be fixed. So, yeah, quite an interesting spawn here. Um, why are the zombies alive again? I killed all of them. And I cannot hit him now. Yeah, as I said, quite a lot of bug, quite a lot of bugs. Let me try to kill him. Can I kill him? Come on, die! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! No, he doesn't want to die. Doesn't look like it. Anyway, so this is pretty much what the mod has to offer. It's pretty good mod. It has a lot of potential. Would really love to start an LP on it. I hope 
the bugs get fixed soon so I can start my LP that would be amazing and that is pretty much everything I wanted to cover in this mod I look totally bad totally badass in this totally badass Let me set a time here to zero I look totally badass yeah anyway thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you all next time